G'day, g'day, g'day. It is not the best day today here. We're upstairs today. It's very rainy and just not really that nice, to be honest. I had my mentor last night and that went for about hour and 50 minutes. First off, we looked at some of the reasons why I'm playing at this level and why I'm not playing at that level and it really came down to some psychological things and all those things that help you get there and how I need to improve that and one of the main things that I looked at was with improving my psychological which is my mind it comes from going through experiences so the more times that I face experiences in football whether it's tough experiences or players getting angry with me or you know, that sort of thing where, or rejection even, the more times I face that, then the stronger my character gets. My mentor always refers to Tevez, where Carlos Tevez, who just moved to China. Carlos Tevez, when he was younger, he lived in Argentina. I don't know exactly where, so. But it was crazy, he always says that he has this mark on his face here. I'll get a picture up, but he has that mark on his face, and when he was younger, he would have to hide under his bed because people were shooting at his house, or, He'd have to walk over dead bodies when he would walk to training or the craziest things that you could think of. His face got burnt, he still has a scar. And a lot of people a lot of people say, why don't you remove that scar? And I'm pretty sure what my mentor said is he doesn't remove the scar because it always reminds him of the worst thing that's happened to him. So if you look at it that way and you have a scar on your face, you kind of go, man, that was tough stuff. Uh, like that's really hard and to have to deal with that for your life having a scar I'm not sure which side it's on but to have a scar where people always judge you that's nothing when it comes to maybe when he was younger he got dropped from the under 15s for some team and it meant nothing to him because he's like well this this is nothing I've got this scar on my face and that's a lot worse than this and it's all about putting things into perspective because really the worst thing to happen in life is death and that's real, real stuff. So it happens a lot. You just have to find the positives in every situation. I always speak about this, whether it's, you know, getting dropped from a team, find a positive. If your teammates are angry with you or your coach doesn't like you, you have to find the positives. It always gives you a chance to grow. So that's what we looked at there. And then after that, we looked at the video. So I made a monthly edit of February. We had three games there and we looked at the three tasks that he gave me and we looked deeper deeper into those and it was interesting because one of the tasks I wasn't quite clear on so now that I'm clear on it and we actually chat well we didn't change it but I thought it was one thing when it was really something else now that I'm clear on it it'll be interesting to see how I can apply that into the game but that concludes my little little chat about that had the worst thing at training I think it was the other night I just haven't got around to fixing it up but in my bag we, we have a shower after training and in my bag I, look, it's not really my fault. Let's put it down to that. In my bag, when we have a shower, I'm actually just going to take this whole bag outside. After training, we always have a shower and people bring their body wash or whatever you want to call it, body lotion. And somehow, I've had it once before in my bag, but this time, one of the bottles, the lid came off or something. Let's have a look. Oh no. Oh, it's a bit on my boot there. I wore these last night. Oh, I can feel it. No, I'm going to have to clean all of these. No, look, you can see it on there as well. Yuck. This is so disgusting. Look, you can see it there. Oh, please don't be on this. Oh, I will... I wish you guys could smell this because it just stinks like body lotion and it is so disgusting. Oh, that's such a pain. So let's open this up. Oh my goodness. Oh, yuck. Look at that. That is all from that. See how the lid came off? So the lid came off and now it's just everywhere. Oh, that's disgusting. Even from up here, I can smell it. I'm gonna get the hose, spray it out. Just get rid of it.
look at all that soap. It's just ridiculous. There's going to be, once I get into that little compartment, there's going to be so much. Don't know how good it is for the plants, but maybe I'm cleaning the plants. Look at this bubble bath. What? That's deep as well. Going to finish cleaning this up and then I'll show you guys the finished product. Okay, this is not working well at all because what happens is I clean it and then it just goes back into the soap. Look how much soap there is. So I think I'm going to hang it by a tree. Let's see if I can throw it on one. Nope. This, this is important because firstly, it's just disgusting to have a bag like that, but it's also about professionalism and making sure that your gear is always up to standard because I don't know if I have gear like that I it's always in the back of my mind that I know I'm not completely prepared <sighs> so I know that I'm kind of maybe slacking off or just it just doesn't give me a good impression and a good feeling whether it's to start the training or after training it just doesn't put me in a good mood so I always want my stuff clean and ready to go this is my plan now Closing it down like that, all the soap runs down. Hopefully this works, please. Please! 20 minutes later and we've finally done it. Just need to hang this thing up on the line. I can still smell it. Not good, I might have to wash it again. Look at this frisbee in the backyard. What should I aim for? I don't know what to aim for. There's a hoop there that I could aim for. Let's try that. Here we go. Oh! One more go, and then I'll try with the football as well, because we got a football down here. I don't know why, don't ask me. Okay, Frisbee, I think I got that one a bit low. That's it. Ooh. Football, should I kick or throw? Feeling, I think most of you would say kick. Here we go. Oh, wow. Come on, come back, come back, come back. Refunds, baby. Attempt number two. Ah, oh, that's shocking. That is just not a good shot. For the rest of the day for me, I have, I don't have to do anything. I was supposed to have two and a half hours coaching this morning, but that got canceled because of the rain. I might go for a surf pretty soon with my mate, but all in all, it's before the game. So the game's tomorrow, so just relaxing. My mentor last night said that the night before the game, I should review the video that I made for last week. So for this week, I'll review, for this week, I'll review the monthly video for February. Watch that one. See what I did do, see what I didn't do. Just the same sort of thing I did with my mentor, but by myself, just before I go to bed so that I have fresh thoughts for tomorrow. This is the IGA that Locke and I used to work at. How, how long do you work there for? Um, like four years. And I worked like five weeks. Yeah, you didn't really last long. Yeah, so my stint there didn't work too long. I worked there for a bit on the weekend only, but then my mentor said to me, he said, why are you doing something like that when you can just do football? And that's when I started doing football coaching and you moved on as well. And it was now. also hard to get into your schedule. Oh yeah, exactly. Oh yeah, because I remember I was doing Saturdays only and then I could only do Sundays and then he couldn't get me on Sundays, so. But now we're do both doing things we love, right? Yeah, exactly. And that's what you got to do. Yeah. yeah. Now, Follow your heart. Follow your heart. What Great advice. Listen to this, man. With the mo. Let's get a close up on that mo. Isn't he beautiful? <laughs> you be the judge. <laughs> Write a comment, tell me what you think. <laughs> Kate, oh, what is it? What's the what's the saying like? Kate, grow. Oh, I don't know it. Should he grow it or should he keep? No, should he keep? Grow or shave. Grow, grow or shave. Leave a comment. There's another look. We got Spencer as well. Dan and Claire in the background. Just going for a walk. Night before the game. Just to chill out. I got. I never ride this thing, but I saw it's in there. A little ripstick. 
just to have a bit of relaxing time for the game tomorrow. And then, like I said earlier, I'll watch the video that I edited for my mentor and then uh, analyze that and then take the key points from that and go from there so that I'm, I have a clear mindset for tomorrow's game. That's going to conclude today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed that. Bit of fun with my brother there. He's sleeping over tonight. He just decided to come over, see the family. Awesome to see him. I don't get to see him too much, so it's always good when he comes around. Looking forward to the game tomorrow. Cannot wait. I'm making sure that just before I go to bed, I watch that video. Have a good night's sleep, wake up early, and get my mind ready for the game. If you guys enjoyed this video, make sure you leave a like, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye. Listen. Listen.